Hi, this is John here with Colorado Custom Covers and Decks again. Uh, we're just going to go over really quick the hangers that um, we use and how to properly install them onto your joists. Uh, so we went ahead and we already got this one temped up. It has some nails holding it in place. Uh, the first thing you want to do is you check your top. Make sure that you're plumb with your ledger board. This one is just about a sixteenth above it, you know, so I'm going to go ahead and adjust it a little bit. So as long as you don't put your hangers on first and you wait till afterwards, you can make those last minute adjustments to make sure you're perfectly plumb up here on the top. Uh, once you're happy with that, uh, you get your Simpson hangers and they just go on either side of the joist. You have to be good and tight on the bottom. Make sure that there's no air under there. So that's where your support comes in. Uh, we use, just use the Tico nailer. I like to put the bottom one in and then the top just to make sure I'm getting good and tight. Okay, I, I don't know if you heard me. I start at the bottom and then I do the top first and then the middles just to make sure I stay good and tight onto the beam. Now, in addition to that, there's these screw holes that are on an angle over here and we use the Simpson uh, number 10, two and a half inch structural screws. So that way when it goes through, it bites onto the ledger as well. So this is just one more uh, way to hold it on. You know, make sure those are good and tight up against the beam. And then you just switch over to the other side and repeat. Holding the top over to make sure I stay tight to my joist. And then just add your final screws. All right, once you have those on there, uh, this is a good solid structure and you can go ahead and start walking on top of it And this is when after this step we'll start the planing which is covered in another video uh, So just remember if you got any questions the deck answers